hello everyone so in this particular video we are going to discuss about a game basically rock paper scissor everyone knows about that okay but now this is a python code and we are going to play with a computer okay so in this particular system what we have done we have used graphical user interface for for interaction okay and in this particular thing we have uh, using our system to randomly choose a thing between rock paper and scissor through which oh, we can just uh, come to know that with who will win okay like uh, i am winning the player is winning or the computer is winning okay so let's see how it works so this is the code for that so i am just running this particular code let's see look this is our system the basic and small gui okay so in this particular thing we have the heading or the label called rock paper scissor player versus computer so if i choose something okay like i'm just choosing scissor so it will just showing that uh, i have chosen just scissor and the computer chosen rock that's why who wins computer wins if i choose paper now the computer chosen scissor that's why the computer wins because computer is smarter than me okay so and again if i choose this paper look paper versus rock player wins okay and again i am choosing the paper computer learned that particular thing that if he want he will click on paper what he have to choose scissor so it is a random example okay uh computer doesn't know what i am going to input so it can't predict it just uh, choosing a random thing between rock paper and scissor okay so if i uh, select rock and the computer also selecting some kind of thing like paper so computer will win if it will select scissor then who will win then i will win the player will win and if the computer will choose rock also then it will draw okay match draw it's just like this so we can just reset the game player versus computer so this is how it works okay so this is a basic gui made by python program and which is working on basically tkinter okay tkinter is a library on which we create these kind of guis and this particular gui can be easily converted into a windows application okay so it can be converted easily into a executable file so what will happen your code will be secured and you can just easily create a windows application to work on that okay or we can say to play with the computer clear so this was today's demonstration thank you students thank you everyone